With a myriad of variety programs on the air in South Korea, Running Man stands out as the longest-running show. After airing 577 episodes yesterday, October 31, 2021, Running Man is a show wherein the cast and celebrity guests are given missions to execute through a series of games. The show has been going strong for 11 years and is regarded as one of the most popular Korean shows around the world. But the nature of it weekly theme, which requires the cast members to stay fit for weekly filming, usually on Mondays, causing a few regular members to drop out off the show, especially idols and actors, mainly because of their packed schedule. Sometimes their schedules collided and it caused fatigue amongst the cast members. Lizzie The after-school group members joined at a very young age, 19 years old. Lizzie chose to leave because Running Man's schedule collided with her schedule of after-school, which was quite busy at the time. She originally appeared as a guest in episodes 13 and 14, but later joined the main cast in episode 18. She also uses a unique Busan dialect when speaking. Lizzie has left Running Man since episode 28, January 2011. Song Jung Ki Before becoming popular now, actor Song Jung Ki was a regular member of Running Man early in his career. But only joining for 40 episodes, he decided to leave because he wanted to focus on acting. He also appeared in episode 66 and has not been a guest since then. Kong Gary In October 2016 the producers of Running Man announced the departure of Gary, who wanted to focus on his music career after being a regular member for nearly seven years. His last filming with the main cast was for episode 324. Gary's departure from Running Man became one of the hot topics. Korean netizens questioning the tricky timeline of his leaving, he left Running Man on October 2016. Besides that, Gary shocked the public by the news that he was married to a non-celebrity. Sudden marriage announcement was made on April 2017 with no one expecting it. Not even his running man family or close friends in showbiz, the only found out from the news. He also cut off all contacts with running man members. In a fan meet in Malaysia, it was revealed that Gary has changed his phone number. It was also revealed that he hasn't been in contact with the running man cast for two months. Even their congratulatory messages to Gary on his marriage went unresponded. He also deleted all posts from Instagram and stopped all activities and promotions. He had also not made any public appearances for a while after his wedding announcement. The Running Man cast was not the only one that Gary left. One day after his marriage, the news that the hip-hop duo has disbanded came out. This led to many fans wondering if Gary is cutting off all ties with the past. However, it was revealed that Gil and Gary were already in the process of closing down their business and selling their building back in January. The company had announced in April, after Lee Sang Company's establishment five years ago, the duo will be branching off and opening their own labels, according to Sumpi article. Last year, Gary appearing on another show with his son, Superman Returns. He recently returned to the Korean entertainment industry after three years of taking care of his family and fans couldn't be more stoked. On the show, where he also introduced his wife and son, Gary explained why he decided to take time off for three years. He said, I feel like after working for over 20 years, I ended up suffering from stress and overwork. While I was away to rest, I ended up getting married and had a child, so it turned into paternal leave. But Gary stressed that he didn't regret taking those three years off work at all. Last one, and very recently, is Lee Kwang Soo. He will end his status as a permanent member of Running Man on May 24. As a result of an accident he experienced a year ago, Kwang Soo was having trouble with his activities, so he chose to take a break. According to his agency, the original cast member is leaving because he's been unable to keep up with the physical demands of the show. After suffering an injury in a car accident last year, the agency said, earlier Kwang Soo's condition had improved and he returned to Running Man. However, his condition worsened again and again and Kwang Soo chose to recover his physical condition until he was really good. Even some Korean netizens speculated that he left Running Man only to focus on his acting career, because he was seen promoting his new film with Sinkhole, on various variety shows after officially signing off the longest Korean variety show. But his fans quickly denied the baseless allegations and clarified that he decided to leave Running Man.
because he needs to undergo major surgery for his ankle, thus he cannot participate the weekly filming of Running Man. Don't forget to subscribe and leave your comment below, thanks. Have a good day.